Oh my God. The whole time I've been talking, I have lipstick on my teeth. No, I better not go that way. Killing ourselves. If you oh, try to open it without killing us, this is not going smoothly. Anyway, I'm gonna need to do this. I'm gonna need to do. Let's try. Oh, Let's see, round seven. everybody, it's PJ, and today we have a witchy unboxing, a witchy unboxing, a witch, okay, whatever, I tried to, do you know, this is like the fifth time I've filmed, hi everybody, okay, just so you know, the dogs were at the door, the birds were making noise, I had lipstick on my teeth, I couldn't get the box open, here I am, anyway, it's a Sabbat box, and as you know, if you'd like to buy anything from sabbatbox.com, uh, go to the website, use coupon code Blessed B, B L E S S E D, all in caps. And uh, yeah, you get 10% off anything in the store or your first box. Yay! Oh, let's see what color it is today. It's black. <gasps> Kitchen witchery. Oh my goodness. Oh. It's all about kitchen witchery. I love that. You know, I have a witch's cookbook that I've never put out, but it's so good. One day I'm going to put that sucker out. Why not today? I don't know. Anyway, this is all about your kitchen and witchcraft, which is like 90% of where all witchcraft is done is right in your kitchen. Herbs, stuff from the ground for earth, fire, water. Think about it. Air, everything. So it's black this time and it says on its little thing, Kitchen Witchery. Isn't that cute? Isn't that cute? I love it. Ooh, okay, so the little uh, the little worms are tan and there's the inside. Let's see what they got us, Bob. Okay, so first off, when I opened the box, this came out, which we know that's our little cheat sheet that tells us what they got how much it cost and how much we saved. We'll be back to this. But next, all this stuff came out. So let's see what it is. Okay, so these are coupon codes, but what statue? Oh, maybe it's in there, I don't know. All right, let's do that last, Never mind. Let me pull. First of, first thing out of the box is, uh, it is, Lugnese, I don't know how to, I've seen this word before, but I've seen this word before, but I'm not quite sure how you say it. It's this word, but I've never really seen it or has listened to somebody else say it. So, um, okay, so this is great. You can put it on candles, your, your body, all that stuff, and it helps you draw in this season's energy. I love it. We're still kind of in mid midsummer, and we're about to hit that amazing um, eclipse, which I want to talk to you about, but not today. Okay, so that's what this is. So awesome! I'm not quite sure what it's for yet, but we'll figure it out. Next, we have a little bag, and you know I love these bags. They give me. They always give me these bags. Oh my God! It's tied open, open, open! Hurry, hurry! <laughs> Oh, it's a stone. Okay. It's a stone. And it has instructions. But let's read what it is first. Okay. So, we have... Oh, is that what this is? Oh. Oh, my God. They're cookie stamps. Oh, I gotta make cookies now. I actually... I'm gonna be taking care of Tim's... Um... I don't know. He's raising her, so child. And I'll be taking care of her um, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday this week because it's Kelly's birthday. And, um, yeah, we can make cookies. It's a cookie stamp. How cute! Oh, my God. Do you know how cool that'll be for, like, Halloween for the kids? It's a witchy cookie. Eat the cookie, kids. <laughs> I love it. This is awesome. Oh, this is going to be so fun. So why did we choose a cookie stamp? These cookie stamps are easy and fun way to decorate your home 
with homemade cookies and bakes is a great way to bring your craft into the kitchen. I love it. That's awesome. That's too cool. Next, we have a really little box thing. This is this is a Kitchen Witch tea light. And look at this. Look at the little. Isn't that kind of cool? This is also cool. Look at this tea light. Look how pretty. It has stones and stuff on it. What does it smell like? Oh, it smells unbelievable. Oh my God, I want a bigger one. Oh, oh, that smells so yummy. Oh my God. That's like exceptional. I'm, I don't usually go that crazy over candles, but that is, I love candles, don't get me wrong, but like I have my favorites and that's it. That's exceptional. Okay, these hand poured tea light candles from the House of Good Juju will make for a beautiful scented addition to your Lamas celebration as well as your kitchen altar made of, uh, does it say? Okay, so this is the smells that, you're, that I was smelling. It's infused with amber, musk, vanilla, oak, moss, cinnamon, as well as myrtle leaves. Wow, that's just the best. That's like the best blend of smells I like have ever had in a candle. That's awesome. Oh, okay. All right. All right. Oh, okay. So here's something. We have the Hedro Cookbook. Look at this. Witchy cooking spells. Look, autumn recipes. Oh, this is so cute. I'm so excited. All right, that was loud. Spring recipes. Look at this. Oh my God. And you know I'm a vegetarian, so hopefully I'll have vegetarian stuff because I doubt it'll make us eat meat and this stuff. Wow. Okay, let's read. This is so cute. I'm really excited. Okay, we've got why we chose it inside the unique seasonal cooking guide for the kitchen witch at heart. Author and, and head witch Glenny. Kindred shares with us her deep knowledge of the plant kingdom. Inside, you'll learn how to prepare, cook, magical, mouth-watering recipes from wild-growing plants, herbs, fruits, and seeds. That's just so awesome. I will love this. Thank you, Seven Box. Okay, so now I kind of waited on this one because, A, because I got to open it. And you know how great those skills are with hands that you can't feel all the way. Wish I, I, one day I'm going to explain to you what I got. Like, why I can't open boxes, why I drop. Oh, I actually found something else. Look at this spoon. Wait, let me get this stuff off it. Oh my God, look at this kitchen spoon. <laughs> That's so cool. It says earth, air, fire, and water. It's like burnt in. Oh, I know, it's so witchy cool. All right, why we chose it. These gorgeous hand-burned elemental kitchen witch wand spoons were custom made for Sabbath box by Primitive Witchery. Oh, they're just so cute. Look how cute. That's going on my wall. All right, so last, I kind of saved this because in these papers, it was talking about my statue. I'm going to guess it's in here because I don't see a statue. I see the box. So, I hate opening boxes. I'm so afraid I'm going to hurt myself. And that's what I was saying. One day, I will get on here and explain what my chronic... Oh, see? What my chronic illness is. And why when I go to open boxes, it looks like I'm going to chop my face off. And it's because I can't feel my hands right. And I... Uh, I have a chronic illness that's actually that's actually not completely diagnosed. Uh, they just call it an undiagnosed rheumatic affliction disease. Uh, that's what, if you look at my undiagnosed rheumatic disease is what they list it as because they're not sure. And I will, I'm going to do a video on what my chronic disease is and what it does to me. So you understand 
Oh wow, this is so exciting. I think I have a statue. Well, I should, because it said something about your statue in the, the paper. I wonder what it is. Oh. What is it? What is it? What is it? Oh, wow. It's a kitchen witch. Oh, she's so pretty. Oh, I love this box. <laughs> I'm going to cry. Oh, I love this. Look at her little crown. I love her crown. Look at her crown. Woo! That is so cool. That is so... That is just ridiculously cool. Oh, I'm so happy. Hello, you're mine. Okay, let's see why they chose it. Why we chose it, with almost a year in the making to be included inside the Sabbath box, is a magical mini corn doll statue by Sacred Source. It's a symbol of abundance and prosperity and is perfect for Lammas or the kitchen altar. I love it. I'm going to make an altar in my kitchen. Oh, that's awesome. And then we got like 20% off of the primitive witchery. I'm going to go, or no, 10%. I want to go in and check this one out because I've seen everything that's on Sava Box, but this is new. So let's go check that out. Let's see. Okay, so then we got this. And they were saying um, that they hope that I like this statue. And it's, this is a sister company, I suppose. Okay, so that's awesome. You, okay, so you can use the discount code SABBATBOX, S-A-B-B-A-T-B-O-X, for 25% off, and then use the 10% blessed be for me isn't that awesome and listen these guys don't sponsor me like they don't sponsor my um any of my videos or anything i literally buy these but i love the company but the other side to it is once they just they just send me stuff like here here's a gift because they talk to me once in a while so it is like the coolest company when i tell you that i don't I don't really care about companies and shit like that. Like, nobody sponsors me. What, are they going to sponsor some old crone? They're not going to do it. But this company, even though they don't sponsor me, they kind of take care of me like a little sister. I love it. Okay, so this is the Corn, do corn Dolly Spirit of the Grain. And then it is a, a little uh, kind of blessings and poems. There's a house blessing. There's this blessing, that blessing. A house blessing, a prosperity blessing, a may we be grateful blessing, and and then just some history of the corn doll in this beautiful parchment paper. So that's my Sabbath box, guys. Oh, and there's a new giveaway. Wow. Ooh, I'm gonna do that. Yes. I love it. All right, guys. So. That's my witchy box. It is all about kitchen witchery, which I love that name. I actually am like, wow, I should, I should start another channel called Kitchen Witchery. My cookbook would be great as the kitchen witchery, but it's actually called the witchy, the witchy cookbooks, the witchy cookbooks for lovers. And then I have one like in my head for children, and then I have one for something else because that's what I do. Anyway. Cause my mind doesn't stop racing all right i love you guys this is an awesome 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 box i am so pleased i can't wait to get started on some of these recipes too oh look at so pretty all right if you'd like to follow me down the rabbit hole that is my life hit the button down below and subscribe give me a thumbs up if you like these kind of videos a thumbs down if you don't either way Got you watching me manifest something lovely in your life if you know it, think, believe it. You can have a two light, a, a kitchen witchery box that is just awesome. Look at what is going up on my windowsill. I love her. All right, guys, I love you. Bye.